Hey you guys, welcome back to our channel. I have a little guest with me today. She is homesick while I'm filming this. I am filming it in advance. We got Amazon, Walmart, and Old Navy to show you today, and it's all things that we are taking to Hawaii. You need to make sure you subscribe to our channel because our trip to Hawaii is right around the corner and you are not going to want to miss it. It's going to be super fun, so make sure you subscribe. So let me just jump right in and explain what this video is all about. So even before we knew we were going to Hawaii, I still like to watch the clearance deals at all the stores and especially online after a season. I don't tend to buy a whole lot of stuff after winter just because it's bulky and I have a ton of long sleeve shirts for all of my girls and so I don't tend to buy a lot of stuff in the winter time but I do like to buy summer stuff. So just two months ago in January we decided to go to Hawaii. Actually we decided a long time ago but that's for a different video. So I immediately started to look online trying to find clearance items, summer items that were still out there on all the different websites to see if I could pick things up for next to nothing and I guarantee you I got things for next to nothing. So we're gonna start at Walmart. I have things that I bought in store and online. So as I've shown you in other videos, Walmart's tank tops, their little spaghetti straps tank tops for women and for girls. I have them for my little girls as well. These little tank tops are $1.68. They're like my stock up item. If I go to Walmart, I always pick these up and then I can go through my old ones and I can just throw them all away because they're a year old. Next thing I bought, when I, I like to wear new pajamas when I go on vacation. I'm in a new hotel, I'm in nice sheets, so I always like to have a new pajama shirt. So I got this one and it said, life is a hoot. I think I've shown this one in a Walmart haul before, so that one's kind of fun. Actually, some of this stuff in the Walmart haul, I've done it before. You did the whole Walmart haul. Yeah. So we got these shorts for Chelsea in store as well, and they were $2.97, so $3. And Chelsea loves them. So Chelsea, she will try and wear these as just regular shorts, but what I want her to do on the trip is wear these under the sundresses and the little um, rompers that we get for them when we're in Hawaii, um, just because they're not quite modest enough, so I like her to put on a pair of shorts. And then for each of the girls, Ashley and Chelsea, I got these cute chambray shorts with the little drawstring waist in both blue and khaki, and they were a dollar a piece. You guys, they're on clearance for one dollar. So I got six pairs. That's the price I would pay for one pair of shorts, and I got six. Why? Why? because they're a dollar and they're really cute shorts. She asks why I would buy something for a dollar. You're crazy. So then we got these shorts for Chelsea. They're nice sport shorts. They're kind of that nice sporty material. So in case Chelsea splashes in the waves before she gets her swimsuit on, which she actually does quite often, these will dry really fast. So then the next thing I got, this is the True and, uh, what do they call this? Time and True brand, just a t-shirt for me. Just a nice coral color. Look at, oh, I can't wait to be in coral colors. I cannot wait. So this one is only $4.44 from just the regular store. I just got it when I was at the store last time. These are the ones that I got online and I was blown away. I have been shopping on Amazon for swimsuits and rash guards for me, just nonstop trying to find one ever since we booked our trip. That was kind of my last thing to buy once I knew for sure that we were going and I could not find one that I liked and that was cheap enough and that fit. I'm not a small girl. <laughs> I need to cover up and I need to protect myself from the sun. You guys, so this rash guard is from Jillian Michaels and it is nice turquoise sea blue and it's got like a mesh yeah, lining in the aqua. back. What? Kind of like aqua color. Yeah, it's kind of like an aqua color. It actually matches my little picture up there. One of my favorite colors. And then it's got the short sleeves it can wick away the water really quick, but it'll cover up my shoulders. That's the main part that kind of gets sunburned from this little white girl um, is my shoulders. So I always like to just kind of throw this on if I'm sitting on the beach drying off or if I'm out snorkeling in the water, I tend to get burned because you're just right laying on top of the water. So I always like to wear a rash guard and then I don't get fried. So I'm trying to remember the price of this guy. I think that he was $5, you guys. I have never found a rash guard for that cheap. And it's not an official rash guard, but it will protect me. So the next shirt that I got is similar material as that. So it's like a nice sporty tank top. 
And then at the bottom, it actually has a little ribbing that is like a, it's almost got elastic material. So it actually holds its shape right at the bottom so that this actually kind of like billows out over it, which I like for my tummy line. I like to kind of hide my tummy and not have it pulled tight with a tank top, but then I don't like my shirts to like sag down like super long. So this one is kind of held up by that elastic band at the bottom. And this one was probably, oh, this one was a little bit more. It was $11, but I liked it because I can just wear it with my pair of black shorts, my black swim shorts. I can be in the water, I can be out of the water. I can even throw this on with a pair of shorts and, a, and a, like a sports bra if I'm, we're, if we're kind of sightseeing, but we know we're gonna end up at a beach or the pool. I can just wear this as we're kind of around town and then I'm ready to go swimming whenever we're, we happen upon a beach. And the last thing that I got, I was shocked. It was probably $8 and it was a full swimsuit top. Double straps, gonna hold the ladies in. I might wear a sports bra underneath it just because I'm a little insecure about it, but it is a nice tankini and it is the really good double layer swimsuit material. It is thick, it's nice. I'm not gonna show through, if you know what I mean. And it's gonna be sturdy enough for me, which is a huge deal, no pun intended. <laughs> I don't mind talking about it, it's fine. I need something to support myself. So I just love that and it goes well with my black swim shorts, like I said. So that is all that I got from Walmart. This little girl's being really good. I told her that she can show her special shoes and her special swimsuit and her special toys in just a second. So she's being very patient. So a lot of the things that I got at Old Navy were on clearance last year when I was kind of shopping at the end of the season. I was able to get these online. I just lay in bed at late at night when I can't go to sleep and I peruse the clearance section on Amazon and Old Navy. So I got this cute little tank top. I can't remember who's gonna have this one, maybe Abby. And I got these for like $2. So you, you find them on clearance and then usually they have like a 40% on clearance items. And then I probably even have like a 20% off coupon that I was able to apply. Then we got this cute white tank top with a little heart on it. This one is probably going to be for Abby or Kaylee. It's just a fun tank top and it was, again, probably $2 on clearance. Now I got these two items. The last time we went to Old Navy, just we went looking for shorts for my daughter and I got a pair of jeggings. Well, they're, they're um, capris. I think these ones were like $3 on clearance um, and I mainly got these ones, one because they were on clearance and Chelsea goes through pants like crazy. But she also gets a little bit chilly at night, surprisingly. My girl who never gets cold during the winter gets a little bit chilly in Hawaii at night with the wind trade winds that come in um, after she's been sunburned and out in the sun all, time, all the time. She, she does get a little bit chilly at night. So I am gonna take a pair of these shorts and for the flight there. So I got those and we it was a funny story. We were at Pizza Hut having lunch with our grandpa right, and our cousins, and the waitress spilled marinara sauce all down the back of Chelsea's shirt. And we had already planned on going shopping at Old Navy right after we went to lunch, so the girl got a new shirt. <laughs> Get it, girl. But I told her she could wear it that one day, and then I needed to put it <laughs> into our bag and take for Hawaii. So this is probably what she will wear on the flight there, the capris, and then the tank, the t-shirt so that she's comfortable on the flight. Another item that I got on clearance online is this tank top. So this one will probably be Abby's. She's my 11 year old. And then Kaylee will get the white one. Just super cute. Again, it was probably $1.50, $2 on clearance. And then I also picked up this one while we were in store for myself. A little bit more than I normally pay for a t-shirt for myself. If you don't know this, I'm a cheapskate. This one was probably $8, but it's cute. And I like this style. I got this one as well. Um, I like the like the baseball tee style with the different colored sleeves and the ribbing around the neck. Just a little bit more flattering with my front line. So I got that one as well. So both of these are from Old Navy. And then it was kind of funny because my daughter wanted a pair, two, like she wanted some shorts, my oldest, and she's gonna be 14 in two weeks. And I told her I would buy one and she needs to buy some just because I'm kind of running out of money and two, because she is earning money and she's capable of starting to buy her own things because it gives her more respect 
for actually wearing them and taking care of them and I'm gonna teach her how to do laundry soon. So I'm trying to teach her that responsibility. So she went in and she found these cute shorts. They were $8, so I told her I would buy one and she could buy the other. They were actually originally $12.99, but they were on sale for eight when she picked them out. And so I agreed to get these ones to go as well. Then when we got to the checkout, she just gave me some cash for the one pair of shorts. So she gave me $9 in cash and then they rang up for $4. <laughs> so she said she wanted her other $4 back. I said, no honey, you just bought yourself two pairs of shorts. You agreed to pay $8 in the beginning, so you still paid $8 in the end and you just went ahead and bought yourself two pairs of shorts. It's all about teaching them the value of money. I just said, you just got a two for one. I'm not paying for it. Ashley, you wanna show them the next thing? What color did you get? This is the main reason why we went into Old Navy the other day. I got yellow. One. She got yellow flip flops. Yeah, I saw pineapple ones, but we couldn't get them. They were not on the $2 sale at Old Navy. So I told her she had to put those ones back because we are on a budget. And then we went ahead and picked up every other color in the rainbow, not quite. But I went ahead and got myself a pair and then each of the other girls got a pair. I do not do well wearing flip flops. My feet are old and they like to be in comfortable shoes. That's the reason why we still have a shoe store that supplies me with really good shoes. But when I am on the beach and I'm kind of back and forth, in and out of the water, walking on hot sand. I do like to put on a quick, simple pair of shoes that I can easily rinse off in the tap water and not worry about it. So we went ahead and picked up our $2 flip flops. Okay, so next up we're gonna show you what we got on Amazon. And it's funny because I initially started this whole process out with a ton of stuff in my Amazon shopping cart. I'd find stuff and I would put it in my little wish list and keep looking, keep looking and finding swimsuits and tank tops. And but in the end, I only ended up buying three things from Amazon because of all the amazing deals that I found at walmart.com, especially for like my tank tops and, and that kind of stuff. Walmart ended up being a better deal. So I only ended up getting three things. So Ashley, you wanna show them what you got? Yeah, I got this cute little swimsuit. I mean, seriously, can I show them? <laughs> look how cute this is, you guys. I mean, not only is it perfect for Hawaii, but look at the bright colors. I like the and then the flowers. shorts. I mean, you guys. I mean, seriously. Can you imagine her little tushy in that? It's so cute. And the little shorts, they just come down right at the top of her thighs. It, it, they're really cute on. I can't wait for you to see her swimming in Hawaii. And it's really, really cute. This swimsuit was probably about $15, $14 or $15, but it's normal price that I would pay at Costco. I just got Chelsea's swimsuit at Costco because I couldn't find one online like this in her size, so I just went and got hers at Costco. This is my probably my favorite thing that we got from Amazon, but it was the one that we took the biggest risk on because it said that the shipping date was going to arrive four days before we leave for our vacation and I was like freaking out. And especially because I wasn't sure about the size. We got a swimsuit for Kaylee, my oldest, who turns 14 four days before we leave on vacation, three days before we leave on vacation. And I was really nervous that we would get this in the mail and it wouldn't fit. Just wait for it, you guys. Check this out. Okay. Seriously, one, it's super cute. Look at those little Hawaiian flowers, and then the beaded waistline, and then look at the back. It's like pink somewhere. And then it has a little tie that ties up in the back. And this one's pink. I know, and then it has like this halter style in the back, a little keyhole in the back. But seriously, look how long it is. Look how long it is. I got it in the mail and I went and picked her up from some activity the other day and I showed it to her and I was like, I'm so sorry, it's not gonna fit you. We're gonna start shopping around, we're gonna go to Target, we're gonna go to all the different stores and we're gonna try and find you a swimsuit, I'm so sorry. She tried it on guys and it fit perfectly. She has such a long torso, such long legs and it literally like took her from a teenage girl into a young woman and it is the cutest swimsuit Again, I can't wait for you to see it. I was a little worried because it has like those, <laughs> she's, you know, she's a teenager, but she's starting to show. And so it has like those little pads here inside the swimsuit. So I was kind of worried. She freaks out about that kind of stuff when she's shopping for things, if you know what I mean? But she put this on she's like, oh, this is gonna be nice. 
it suddenly dawned on her that maybe she needs to have something covered up when she's in the water and maybe getting out and being a little bit cold. So I was grateful for her kind of graduating into that little phase of being a young woman and understanding. So that was kind of nice. Then the last thing that we got from Amazon and I have been searching for these for months, even before we knew we were going on our trip, I've been looking for these because I threw away my old pair. You probably have seen me done a million cleaning videos in the old pair of capris that I had, but they had to get thrown away last season. And so I went ahead and found another pair. Yes, I like my elastic waist. I'm not a small girl, so I like it to be comfortable. So I just got a nice pair of khaki Bermuda shorts. They go right below my knee line and then they have a little cuff on them and then they have cargo pockets. As a mom, I just need to be comfortable. I need to be able to be on the go, put things into my pockets if I need to, but also I need to be modest. It's kind of a religious thing for us. I need to have my shorts cover up my knees, make sure that I'm comfortable. So that was a killer find. I got these for, I think they were 19 or 20. Still a good deal. I am grateful that I found them because these will last me a couple years because I just wear them from the springtime clear until the fall. They're kind of my go-to style of shorts because I don't like to show my knees. I don't mind showing my knees, my, but my shorts need to go down to my knees. And next up is just a few things from Target. One I've already shown you, the shirt that I just got at Target. I will take that to Hawaii with us. And then I surprised the kids with these just the other day, showing them that we got some swim toys to take with us. They won't weigh very much, and I'm gonna take them out of the packaging and put them in our suitcase. But they love diving for things when they're at the pool. And if we go to shallow beach areas that are enclosed, they can dive for these as well because they're easy to find underneath the water and they won't get swept away with the waves. These are from Target and they got them on clearance for $2. And then this one is one of those kind of like, it's like a ball sponge type thing where they fill up with water when they you kind of like squeeze it and fill it up with water and then you throw it and it splashes on them. And they were $1.48. So, I mean, I got these ones at the end of summer season last year. So I'm sorry if that's a long video today. We'll try and shrink this down as much as we can, but we are super excited to go to Hawaii, but this is how we do it on a budget. I spend many, many months trying to look for a good deal, save money where I can. These are items that I would buy for the summertime anyway. I always buy the girls new flip flops going into the summertime, but I wait for Old Navy to run these for $2. For whatever reason, I didn't buy them at the end of the season when they were only a dollar. Maybe I'll find them here in the house somewhere. Maybe I did, but for $2, that's still a good deal. So I just like to look for a good deal, especially when we're going on an expensive vacation. It's actually not expensive for us. So if you haven't seen that video, you can go and check out how we do Hawaii on a budget because I have a lot of tips for that. So that is it, you guys. I appreciate you coming along for this little haul. Ashley, did you have fun? Can you guys, oh, what do we say in Hawaiian when we say goodbye? Aloha. But you also say mahalo. All right, you guys, take care. Thanks for joining us. Make sure you go and subscribe. I promise you, you're gonna love our Hawaii videos and our, we're gonna daily vlog every single day. Take care, subscribe, come back for more because we are about to go to Hawaii. All right, bye guys.